Hi everyone. I am headed down to the woods, at least the clearing that we cleared out, to plant some pumpkins. So I have a bunch of different pumpkin seeds. I'm gonna put that in gourds. There's some gourds in here too. I'm gonna put them in the ground down there. Um, I don't plant them in my garden because pumpkins just kind of go everywhere and need a lot of space, a lot of square footage. So they can grow down there in the weeds with all the water they want because it's pretty wet down there. And I think they're gonna do awesome. Normally, the goats get the pumpkins from last fall and they eat them and then I'll clean out the pen and everything goes down in the compost pile. And usually in the spring we grow pumpkins that I didn't have to plant. So we're going to see if me actually intentionally planting them in a spot down there that I've taken and put some compost on works out. Or if it doesn't. I've never tried it before. I think it'll work. But I don't know if it's just the goats that have the green thumb or if there's a chance that I can get them to grow too. So come along and I'll show you what I'm planting and where I'm putting them. And then we can track those all summer. So we're going to go down here. I like it when we keep a path mode to go down here. So much easier than walking in the knee-high grass. At one point, we cleared this out down here. Kind of left it hidden a little bit but cleared this out down here one because here's the manure pile the compost pile where I put everything from cleaning out the critters and then I had we had cleared this out because we talked about putting a barn down here but it's so far from the house house is way up there um just getting here in the winter and keeping in the snow cleared out in the winter did not sound like an awesome fun plan so we decided that we won't do that my husband had planted some grass down here last year um, we talked about possibly kind of fencing it in uh, this whole hedgerow down in here so we could turn the goats down here so they could you know munch on the trees it's really pretty peaceful down here um, we had this gorgeous tree that had this grapevine over it it blew down in a windstorm last year. It was so sad because it made this beautiful archway. So my husband um, put up some poles and some wire. He's got to bring a machine down to pick the end of that up. But we were going to try and put the archway back up. Focus. There we go. Going to try and put that archway back up. We'll see. We'll see if we're successful with it. Um, I'm hoping that it'll live because it is really pretty. And normally we mow a path right underneath it, but we will see. On to the project at hand. So over here, I mowed a path down to it to at least get rid of some of the weeds for now. I put sticks in the ground, but I really just stuck them in the, the piles of compost, so it isn't like there's anything to really support them and hold them up. But these are going to be my piles for the pumpkins. And the gourds. Oh, oh, oh. Gonna make the people sick. Make the people sick. Don't do that. Don't do that. Okay, put this stuff down. So we came down and did this when it was cold. It was like 40 degrees. And the reason I did that, when it's 40 degrees, there's not bugs. There's all kinds of bugs now when it's 60 degrees. So what I have are, I have some autumn wing blends which are some small gourds i have i think it's jardale yep jardale pumpkins which are green ones um a large orange pumpkin i tried to say the names but i would butcher them i'm really really not good at that this one should be a large orange pumpkin that's Champion, I can say that name. This should be a large orange pumpkin. Blaze. Harrow Smith Select Gourds, so some more small gourds. Another pack of the Autumn Wing. 
And then polar bear, which should be some, I think medium or small, medium, small sized white pumpkins. So I'm going to get those planted. I'm going to put a couple in each hill. The seeds are all old, so I'm not exactly sure how well they will grow because I think the seeds are at least two years old. So I'm going to go a little heavy in case the germination is not as good as it should have been. And we will see how they do this year. pumpkins planted um, I planted two hills of each I went with Jardale the one that I'm sure is easy to say but I can't say it don't tell me to sound it out because I won't get it right I promise Casparita Casparita that's my guess polar bear champion and blaze and I started at the far end and came this way so I have two hills left I'm going to kill mosquitoes and then I'm going to plant um, plant my gourds That's the pumpkins and the gourds. We will see how they grow. Wish me luck. We'll see if the weeds overtake them or what. There's enough bugs down here. I swear I just saw an aphid. But I don't know what it would be doing. I don't think there's that much down here for it. But hey, there's enough spiders though. Thanks for coming along.